This is David from the MDC Design Studio, and today I'm going to tell you about Gramercy, which is a really lovely image, but it has an interesting story. We began thinking about formalism. These are paintings that are done in about 1900, the beginning of the 20th century, and they just have color and form to them. They have no narrative, no context whatsoever. But we wanted to create a painting that mixed some concepts about literature as well, and we wanted to go back to the early 1940s to the 50s, and we thought about the downtown setting and poets like Allen Ginsberg, and make a painting that would hang in, in a poet's apartment at that time period. So when we think about New York at that time, we have to remember it was a very gritty urban place, particularly downtown New York. It wasn't this skyscraper, Mies van der Rohe commercial city that we we live and see today. It was this very, very rough context. So when we think about revolutionary poets or painters at that time, we have to understand the space in which they were creating and how forward-thinking and how innovative these concepts were. But in our painting, you'll take a look at it here, it has still this roughness to it. And really, as we merge these two things together, we think about the pre-expressionists or the early expressionists who were living and working downtown. And they were beginning to work with form, but then break it apart entirely and just give a passion to color and form. And that's really what Gramercy has. So then when we came to the name, we thought about Gramercy Park, because we think of this as a quintessential downtown, old New York space. And in today's world, in our contemporary time, it's also the home of the Gramercy Park Hotel, which is a very chic, modern place, but it's also very rustic, and uh, it's got all these warm tones to it. But we also think that our painting Gramercy would fit in a space like this. It's rustic minimalism, which puts these two things together. So here's our Gramercy. We think it's a great, beautiful painting, and we hope you enjoy it. Thank you.